What's up, BB fam? We gonna grind it out here again on these YouTube streets. A brand new year once again here on these YouTube streets. Not looking for fame, just doing our thing here on these YouTube streets. We going to mukbang it. Let's show some mad love here on these YouTube streets. With these delicious dishes, we're gonna blow your mind here on these YouTube streets. Setting our grind one bite at a time here on these YouTube streets. Popping beers and bottles. Painting our faces Everybody up like fat bitch models. Welcome to the freak show, the best in town. We here, oh, baby. Here I'm here on with these YouTube streets. I've been living in my own head, constantly yes, thoughts sure. double ground. Think I need a little it's bottom in white. Hey, y'all. How's it going? Guess what? It's your boy, Vern Bang. Yes, honey, it's your boy, Vern Bang. And we are back with another video. But before we get into this video, you know we got to get God some glory. Lord Jesus, thank you for this day. Thank you for everything you do in our life, Lord. I just want to pray for everybody in this whole wide world. Lord, please bless the people that do not have. Get them what they need. Let's put that triple, ripple, dimple power of protection and anointing on everybody in this whole wide world. Show them from anything that's coming for them. Bless them and cover them the blood of Jesus Christ. In your name I pray. Amen, amen, amen. Alrighty, y'all. So, anyways. Yes, we're having a little lunch today. Today is Saturday. My first Saturday off in a long time. So, I'm off Saturday and Sunday. And I gotta go back to work on Monday at 9. So, but this is what we got today. We got some noodles. Uh-huh. We got some coconut shrimp. And we got some egg rolls. So, yes. And I'll tell you what kind of egg rolls. And then on the side, as always, we got a plethora of sauce, you know, because I'm a sauce whore. A real big bit of the sauce whore. We don't miss no sauce. We... <laughs> <Ba -boom. laughs> All right, so I got some uh, gimme roasted uh, sesame snacks, and this is teriyaki flavor. These are really good, and I like them because they're roasted. So we got those to eat with it. And I'm going to dress my noodles up. So we got a little uh, sesame oil. So I'm going to add just a little sesame oil. Uh -huh. Okay, so we got some sesame oil. And what I wanted was some of this. Oh, it looks like it's pliable. No, let's see. Because I like the sweet soy sauce that we got to get some more of oh yeah so i think that's gonna be enough we don't need that soy sauce and i got the futakaki i like putting it on my noodles yeah baby it's just a mixture of all kinds of dried goodness and we got us some wasabi because I want some for my coconut shrimp. But I also like to put a little bit on my noodles as well. So here we go. You can see me better now. Here we go. Now let me get you up close. <laughs> looky dear, looky dear. Let's see. If we can get a good there. <laughs> All right, so we'll give you up close to the plate. We got some beautiful, beautiful noodles. We got this gorgeous coconut shrimp, and we got these beautiful, beautiful egg rolls. Now, these egg rolls, I didn't have egg roll wrappers, but I used my uh, flour tortillas. And they're jalapeno cream cheese, like uh, Mama Appetite made a long time ago. That started the egg roll trend. But anyways, uh, let's go ahead and get into this. Uh, what y'all eating with me? How y'all doing? 
Because you already know, once I start eating, whew, that be. Cheers, y'all. Mmm. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. Let me get you a bite. There you go. Get you a worm bang bite. Get you a VB bite. Oh my god, that food of cocky, the sesame oil. Mm. Don't taste the sweet sesame that much because we running on low and I think I Added a little soy sauce to it, but still, it's diluted down. So we'll just add a little bit more soy sauce. But yeah, these are really good. <laughs> Big old bite. Goodness, goodness, goodness. We got some root beer. Okay. Here's one of these coconuts. Now, these coconut shrimp, they're made by uh, a company called Tasty, and you can get them at your Dollar General store. They have the plain breaded ones, which are like five bucks, and I think these are a little bit more. Uh, the coconut ones, they might be the same, I don't know. I didn't look at the receipt when I bought them, but I know the other ones, the normal ones are like five bucks. But you get like ten of them in a box. Already bread it, and then you just throw them in the air fryer for like 10 minutes, and they're perfect every time. I highly recommend. <laughs> and they taste so good. And if you like their shrimp a little crunchier, you probably go about 15 minutes. They're so good. And these, these gimme's I ordered from Walmart.com, but I had to order the whole box. They were like 20 bucks, but you get like 12 packs of them. And these are really good. And like I said, they got them in wasabi, they got them in teriyaki flavor. And they're roasted, so they got a little deeper flavor than most and what I like doing with them is I like taking my noodles mm -hmm. take up my noodles put some noodles yep and I got two papers on here and just wrap them up like that there you go there you a little seaweed taco noodle taco seaweed noodle taco Seaweed noodle taco. Hey. Mmm. 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 They're flavorful, beautiful teriyaki flavor. Mmm. -hmm. Perfectly seasoned and roasted. That roasted brings that flavor out. Mmm. All right, let's check these out because I think they're set long enough. Mm. And this has a whole jalapeno. Mm -hmm. I didn't even bother taking the seeds out because I wanted the heat. And cream cheese, that's it. Like I said, I didn't have the egg roll wrappers. Get you a bite. Get you a VB bite. So I just used the tortillas and rolled them in and stuck them in the freezer till they were frozen. 
and just throw them in the air fryer for about 20-25 minutes. Drizzle a little canola oil on top or whatever oil you got. Or if you got the spray can, it's even better. Spray them with a little bit of oil. Mm. And they are so good. So if you want to make you some egg rolls but you ain't got no egg rolls, use you a flour tortilla. It works just the same. I do recommend freezing them until they're firm. Um, and you, like I said, you can air fry or you can throw them in some pearl. Either way. Mm. But that good. That good flavor. Crunchy. That cream cheese and jalapeno flavor. That popper flavor, baby, coming through. Go watch you some Mama Appetite Kitchen. I did these a long, 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 long years ago. When they first came out, and then there was a challenge where you try to eat 10 of them, but baby, they're hard to eat 10 of them, let me tell you. But it's an iconic Mama Appetite creation and flavor. And she's got many, many more of these egg rolls. I've seen people doing birdias, saying they got the recipe from her. Birria egg rolls, and I've seen different style of egg rolls that she's done. And if you do not know who Mama Appetite, that's Big Guy Appetite's mom. And she has her own cooking show. And go check out Big Guy Appetite as well. He's a content creator, he does mukbangs and stuff, and food reviews, go to restaurants. Yes, honey. So yeah, go check these out. These are good. Mm. And normally you would add bacon to this, and I didn't have I didn't have any bacon, so I didn't add the bacon. The bacon would make it a popper, but I didn't have the bacon, so these are baconless. So they're popper-ish. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, you can also just do that, pick it up, and eat it like that. want to get savage with it. <laughs> mm. This is such a good little lunch, let me tell you. Stands, but I never heard back from him. So, earlier this week, uh, 
I just reapplied. <laughs> Let's see. I'll talk to you to give it to me because it's 1200 bucks I make a month it goes back into the house. So give me a place to live. So. I'm sure I'll get it, so. No worries there, so instead of having to, you know, the funds to go buy something. Weird is going to do a regular slit slider Sunday. We'll gear torch, uh, the St. Patty's Day, but we just going to do nothing special. I don't even know where my hat and stuff is at. I probably was still packed in a box at my sister's house. <laughs> oh well. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, I think it's better to do. Let's see, we'll do a trifecta. <laughs> okay. Try this again. There we go. Mm-mm-mm. Uh. Yep, it's been raining in Texas. Yeah, they said it was going to rain Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. It didn't rain Wednesday or Thursday. I think it may have drizzled one of those days a little bit, but then it didn't rain no more. It definitely didn't rain Thursday or the rest of the day Wednesday, and it was supposed to come a storm Friday. It didn't rain Friday. It rained a little bit in that early morning, but that was it, and then... It may have rained last night, but I was out like a light bulb, so I didn't hear nothing. But. It rained about half an hour. Real good. And that's it so far. <laughs> so. So much for our rainy weather. But where's the, what's the weather doing in your area? Let me know. But anyways, y'all, I'm full. We'll snack on this throughout the day. And anyways, have a blessed weekend. Peace. Day trail. And you've been, ha, <laughs> Vern Bang. Yes, honey, you've been Vern Bang once again. Oh, yeah, and stay tuned because you ain't never know what you're going to see or hear over here on this uh, channel. Peace. And we're going to catch you on another one. Bye.